we are. When she's not rescuing dogs. Gumbo was the first adopted, then came Lucy. Fluffy is a, a rescue. She is serving her country. I'm Lisa Yanity, and I am a major in the United States Army Reserve. During her second tour of duty in Afghanistan, Major Yanity received unexpected news from home about her dog, Sage. Got the call that she wasn't doing well. So um, the folks that were house-sitting, they took her back to the to Banfield, and it, it was time. The gentle six-year-old lab mix was dying. She had chronic renal failure. Knowing Major Yanity could not return home to say goodbye, the Banfield team made sure Sage could hear her mom's voice one last time. They allowed me to be on the phone during the time that she was put down. Um, and that, that made it a little easier, not completely, but I knew she was surrounded by people, people that cared about her. However, thousands of miles away, I was there. And her presence was felt. It was a healing moment the Major will never forget. I got some closure that I wasn't completely, that I completely abandoned her. Then, two months later, the unthinkable. We immediately recognized who Rue was, Major Yanity's other dog. That's what we call spondylosis or spinal arthritis. Major Yanity's gentle protector of 12 years and playmate of Sage was in poor condition. The team did not want the Major to lose another family member while serving her country. And of course the thought process was to make sure we could keep her comfortable until Major Yanity can come back. That's exactly what they did. Their compassion and commitment to Rue's care paid off. She made it till I got home and... Yanity feels fortunate to have had two months of unconditional love from Rue before she had to say goodbye. She says the Banfield team gave her peace of mind knowing her girls received top-notch care while she was away. When you're over there, the little things here that you can't control or you're used to being part of weigh on you very much. They helped alleviate that burden. So touched by the support her family received by the Banfield team during a difficult time, Major Yanity gave the staff one of the highest military salutes. She had a United States flag flown in their honor at her base in Afghanistan. In fact, when I first saw it, I just, I couldn't believe it. The chill bumps were just crazy. <laughs> for Major Yanity, it was her way of showing the team her deep gratitude for building a sense of trust, compassion, Let's say sorry for your loss, Rue will be missed. And confidence in the care her girls received at Banfield. I recommend Banfield um, very much so. They, uh, they, like I said, they treated us as a family. Because of that experience, she will forever be a loyal client. Come here, Luke. Come here, Fluffy. Major Yanity says she will continue her mission of caring for those less fortunate with the help of her partners at Banfield. When it's time for them to go, all they ask of us is to make room for others. And, well, that's why I have three more. <laughs>